Okay, so we'll start off with a little bit of backstory on Pirates. Pirates are the first new class branch to be added to MapleStory after the official launch. In October 2008, during the version 0.61 update, the outer entrance of Nautilus Harbor was made visible prior to the actual release in version 0.62, which followed about a month afterwards. During the tease period, there was a short questline added regarding other regions' concerns for their arrival, so that's where we'll pick up. So, the King of Ludibrium receives a mysterious letter and he decides to become allies with a new, unidentified, powerful force. One of his guards, Marcel in particular, wants you to find out more information about this new group. Lisa, from Orbis, was flying over the ocean when she spotted a large steel creature the size of a town that could both float on the water and dive below. She followed it to Victoria Island where it stopped. Worried about an attack, she asks you to investigate the creature. The chieftain of the Halflingers, Tanamo, notes that while they don't have to worry about their safety due to the dragons protecting them, they aren't blind to the rest of the world. There are recent rumors of a powerful group of individuals, and he's unsure whether to welcome them or watch out for them. So he asks you to learn about them and then report back. The Infamous broker of Magatia, Han, has, or Han, <laughs> has concerns due to someone purchasing an inordinate, ordin, inord, inordinate, <laughs> inordinate amount of refined steel, jewels, and alchemic sources of energy. It's enough to start a war, apparently, according to him. He asks you to check on who made the outrageous deal and find out if they seem dangerous or not. And finally, we have the leader of Hennessy's, Chief Stan, that states that Victoria Island as a whole is worried over rumors of the group of suspicious people that have been seen around the eastern shores. From what he's heard, they roam around in weird costumes and carry unusual weapons. Some people claim to hear puzzling sounds near the shore, so he's interested in finding out what they're up to. So after gathering all the information and quests from the leaders of these different regions, you go east of Hennessy's and you find like this fort entrance and there's a little lookout kid or guy. It's hard to tell, I guess. So the lookout of Nautilus, Bart, stands outside of the fort's gates. He tells you that he will protect Kirin and the Nautilus before realizing that you're just looking for information about them. Bart tells you that they are just fearsome, fight to the last man, potion-loving pirates. They ride around in their ship, the Nautilus, under the guidance of their captain, Kieran. Roaming the coasts of the Maple World, looking for clues on the whereabouts of the Black Mage, here they call him the Black Magician though. They serve a cause true to the spirit of Victoria Island. They make sure that his followers stay in low numbers, and they tirelessly work to combat the evil. Unlike Lord Pirate and his despicable bandits, uh, that would be PPQ, or Pirate PQ from Herbtown related stuff. They wish to vanquish the root of all evil and the source of darkness once and for all. However, they aren't fully set up yet <laughs> and haven't finished constructing their fort and harbor. So Bart invites you to join them in the near future to train and live the life of a pirate, promising to accept you with open arms. So yeah, um, pirates. I haven't actually read through the old initial Nautilus quests, so there's probably more lore to the pirates' beginnings or their inception or something like that, but I haven't actually looked through it yet. Although for this dialogue, it took a lot of deep digging to find these quests. Anyway, if there's anything important that I'm missing, let me know.